Good morning, Norwood School. It's Mr. Void again, and today is Thursday, April 23rd. Hopefully yesterday was an awesome day for you, and today is going to be another great day as well. Um, as you know, if you watched our morning announcements yesterday and saw Mrs. Salamani, yesterday was Earth Day. Um, we did receive a couple pictures from students in Mrs. Taub's class, so I'd like to share those with you in just a moment. But I just want to remind you, if you are creating any pictures for Earth Day or did anything special at all, please be sure you're sending pictures of those things our way. I do have uh, several pictures that you've been sending that I will be sharing tomorrow. So if you sent a picture from your teacher, don't worry, I did get it and I will be sharing those tomorrow. So make sure you're back here tomorrow to see all the pictures um, that have been sent to me over the last day or two. Uh, so before we introduce our special guest teacher, I want to show you those pictures that we've received from Mrs. Taub's class to celebrate Earth Day. All right, and thank you again to those students who shared pictures. Remember, keep them coming. Um, boys and girls, right now I want to introduce our next special guest teacher. Say hello to your phys ed teacher, Mr. Switzer. Hey, what's up, Nolwood? It's Mr. S coming to you live from the basement. We're going to do a little warm-up activity today, get us loose, get us ready for class. Um, and if we commit this to memory, you know, this is something we could do every day. So what we're going to do, real simple, 20 seconds each movement. Run in place, jumping jacks, arm circles forwards and backwards. We'll do 10 and 10 seconds forwards, 10 seconds backwards, and we'll finish it off with, uh, with huggers. All right, so I'm going to just show you how to do them, and then you guys can get after it. Here we go. So run in place. Nice and loose. You won't get crazy. You go sideways. You go real fast. We're just jog. All right, and we get jumping jacks, 20 seconds. Okay, when that's done, we got forward, swimmers, do some backwards, and then cross body, hold these huggers, give yourself a big hug. All right, shake it out, and then you're done. Do that one time, two times, three times, however many you want. Hope you guys are all doing well, and I look forward to seeing you soon. Stay strong. Good morning, Knollwood families, and welcome back. I hope you had a wonderful Wednesday and you are ready to have a fabulous Thursday. Your kindness challenge for the day is an easy one. Um, and your challenge is to say one kind thing, or more if you'd like, one kind thing to every member of your family today. One kind thing to every member of your family today, and even say something kind about yourself. That's always important as well. I think you guys can handle that challenge. It's a pretty easy one. I hope it brings a smile to your family members' faces. Now, before we end today, here is the video from a first grader in room 19 who created his own awesome get video game, and we'd like to show you a clip of it now. My name is Chin Mei. I made a game called Save the Earth for the Juni Hackathon so I got spikes, I got coronas. So you use the space bar to shoot the coronas so that you, you can get five points. So when you get five points, you win. So if the Corona touches the edge, it'll minus you a point, even if you're at zero. So now let's go to the Earth Saver. The Earth Saver has some, he has when backdrop switches to level four. He has when right arrow. When left arrow, so with the right and left arrows, you have you can move. Now the medicine. The medicine is a drop of hand sanitizer that kills the coronavirus. So that's how it gets defeated. Now I'm gonna play the game.
So, I hope you like my explanation. If you have any questions, let me know. Thank you.